Hi everyone, this is your girl Anna and welcome to my channel. First of all, I want to thank you guys for taking the time to watch my videos because every little thing that you do here in my channel, whether you hit that like and subscribe button, turn on that notification bell, or leave a comment in any of my videos, I know that someone out there appreciates what I do and I thank you for that. As you can see in the title down below, today I will be showing you my top 5 favorite Instagram illustrators. Those are the people who shape me and help me find my art style which they probably don't know about. So I'll be dedicating this video to them. Throughout this video, I will be putting their names on Instagram so you guys could check them out. I've made my very first post in Instagram back in January 21st, 2017. and. On a future video, I would probably recreate the specific art, which is this, as a celebration of my third year anniversary. So without further ado, here we go! First in my list, but in no particular order, is Natalia. As you can see, she is three years younger than I am and she is from Poland. I really love her art style, but what I like the most about it is hers looks kind of realistic and fun at the same time. I actually think that she is great at color matching unlike I am that goes more towards safer colors like black. What's fun about her page is she makes these satisfying videos like this that I really love to watch. It's almost like being hypnotized. Every day, one of the first thing I do in the morning is to check if she uploaded new videos in her YouTube channel. You guys should definitely check her out. She uses a lot of marker as a base and shadow for the color and a colored pencils for fine details. Next in my list is Zoe. Oh, how I wish I could go to her classes. I mean, if you guys are or were one of her students, I envy you. Aside from being so talented, she is also down to earth considering how successful she is. I learned from her the basics of fashion illustration, so if you guys are just starting to do fashion illustrations, I recommend that you check out her YouTube channel. She has this Facebook group where she does weekly challenges for her members, and I think I joined two or three of those. Don't quote me in this, but I think she has about 130 plus video tutorials, so yeah, you probably got a lot to catch up if you haven't started yet. Then, here is Jargo from Australia. When it comes to drawing slash illustrating slash painting gowns, I love watching her techniques. She first uses watercolor, then fill in the details with color pencils, and my favorite part is when she uses glittered glues. So when you see in my videos that I was using those, I got the technique from her and I give her all the credit for that. I actually draw this Dolce & Gabbana from the collection of Spring 2015 last April 2018, but mine was nowhere near hers. If you follow me on my Instagram, you will notice that my three previous posts since Christmas were all digital that I created using Procreate app. Well, I blame it to her, Tess. Her art is just so amazing that every time I see it on my feed, I almost all the time immediately grab my pencil and iPad. I mean, come on, Tess. People like me that loves you got other things to do. Anyways, most of my digital illustrations were inspired by hers. The last, but definitely not the least, is Ellie. Oh my gosh, I'm so proud to be a Filipino right now because of her. I mean, if you guys would look at her profile, she just never runs out of inspiration. She draws Spongebob, Stranger Things, Mean Girls, Disney Princesses in her own style, and it's just out of this world. So yeah, those are my top 5 favorite Instagram illustrators. Again, in no particular order, Natalia, Zoe, Suljargal, if I'm pronouncing it right, Tess, and Alice, thank you very much for sharing your talent to everyone. Thank you guys for watching, and please, please, please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. I'll see you in my next video. Bye!